Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Roxanne and today I thought I would do um, a Jeffree Star mystery box look using the products I got from the mystery box except for a few things like foundation, um, mascara, which, you know, I didn't get but I do have um, and things like that. So I thought I'd go through the whole process with you. Um, and we could do a whole get ready with me and you guys can see um, how I did it and what products I use. So I am going to use the pale yellow. Now this is supposed to be good for getting rid of the dark spots under your eye. So let's hope because I did not sleep a wink last night. Now will it cover the dark spots on this eye? I, it's hard to say because um, I have a birthmark, so um, I'm not exactly sure. Um, so let's get at it. I've already put this down. I hope this doesn't. I hope this isn't too long. But I actually think that did a really great job. Okay, so I'm actually going to step off camera. I'm going to do my primer, and I'm going to use the Good Apple and as well as the actual concealer. Um, okay, so I did use some of this natural uh, translucent luminous setting powder. You can probably see it. I did use um, my doll tan for uh, my refocusing palette for the blush and um, a bit of contour. Okay, so I also used the lavender that I got in the last <laughs> A mystery box as well um, I have to admit like I put the yellow and then I put the the regular concealer on top and it looks really good it's not creasing and then I put the um, the lavender underneath and so far it looks really good you can kind of see that the purples left there but yeah no I haven't used any highlighter so that translucent powder really does give you a nice shimmer okay so I do have here the three palettes that I did get. So I got the Mini Controversy in green with the green, um, the Weirdo palette, and um, the Cremated. So I'm going to use one color from each. I'm going to make this a very simple look. I would... Let's see here. Okay. And I do have the eyeliner although that's not the uh, this is the eyeliner so I did get the the red love me not from there but I also got um, cherry wet and the red um, red affair so I'm gonna try to use those and I'm gonna use the Leo lip liner okay I'm sorry guys I'm just kind of off off of my game today, the last few days I've had really bad anxiety. Um, this weekend was filled with going out, so now I feel very congested. But um, my daughter's had a, a cold and she was sleeping with us last night because she has a bit of um, a diaper rash, I guess you would say, because she was just on antibiotics and she refuses to eat yogurt <laughs> would really help if she did that okay um that's enough about me tell me how you guys are doing leave me a comment in the below um maybe some good news um just something anything uh i know oh shoot so i'm using anastasia and then i just like put a whole bunch on my brush and i don't need that much okay so I do have a look in mine. It's just going to be three colors. So one color from each. And then that is it. I know. I'm not going to try to use nine colors on my eyelids. No. Whoa. I know you guys are as surprised as <laughs> I am. Um, I just want to do something quick, something fun. Um, something I don't have to worry about too much. I won't be using lashes today just because I do have to go get Avalon soon. And you know, I really suck at putting on lashes. I am getting better, but 
And as you can hear, my my doggies in the background. Clumpity clump clump clump. I still feel like I put more on this side than I did on the other side. Maybe I did. I don't plan on going this high with my... I forgot how much I like the good apple. Foundation. It's good. Okay, so... I'm going to go in actually with, I think it was mini controversy, yes. So I'm going to go in with Mohawk first. I love this color. Love, love this color. I think this will be like a staple color in my looks. This is just so gorgeous for a matte. And technically I could actually use the only child, but I'm not. I'm gonna use uh, Controversy from the second palette, just cause then it gives a diversity because how often do you pull out three palettes maybe you do I know I don't I'm really bad for that I don't I'm like I have to use one palette and one palette only because ones if they don't have the second palette well you know what you can do a different color so I am gonna go in with controversy I know I want to use this green really really bad but today is just not the day to do it okay so I'm gonna start at the corner here and just so I did move the camera, so let me know, does that work better for you guys? Like, um, and do you guys want me to do a live? Like, I was going to do a live on yesterday, last night, but I just, like I said, my anxiety is bothering me a little bit, so, um, yeah, like, maybe I could do it Wednesday. Would you guys be okay with Wednesday, let's say at 7 o'clock, and um, I can do a look, and I can put up a... A poll on Instagram and you guys can tell me what you would like to see um, I think I'm gonna go for a whole month of uh, cutting down my spending this month um, because we do have Christmas coming up and I do have two boys birthday at the end of this month Lucas's birthday was this week his was Tuesday and we got ahead we we got into some shenanigans on Tuesday so we just had a quiet night, him and I. Okay guys, what do you think of this look so far? Totally not me kind of like in the depth of how, you know, dark I can go, but. And you're like, where's the shimmer? It's coming. Ooh. and my face is so itchy right now. I don't know why. Okay, so I am going to pull out this controversy. I mean, how can you not love, sorry, this is cremated. I don't much care for black and whites, like, and grays and neutrals, but this has some of the best shimmers, and, oh, uh, it's just gorgeous. Um, so what I'm going to do is actually take Diamond Ashes, which you can see has been used a lot on mine. It's right here. Right there. Yeah. I, I, I do use this one a lot. So I'm going to take like a flat brush and I'm going to... Now it's more of just a really, really shimmer shade. So as you can see, it's really nice to put over top of this beautiful Mohawk color, right? Like how gorgeous is that? Can you guys see? Oh, wink. There. I'm not sure if anyone needed that today, but. Oh. Uh. Ugh. 
and I'm actually going to go over the whole eyelid. Like I said, just something simple, something neat, something that you can do. You don't have to worry about, you know. You can get away with. I love this color. This color is so beautiful. And really, I could have actually put um, a death blow under all of this to kind of bring out the colors in it. Oh, no, stop. I'm just going to take a little bit of this angel of death and I'm just going to put it right there. One thing I do really like about, sorry, um, about these palettes is just how pigmented they are. I didn't dip that back into the pan. I just, oops, where did it go now? Did I use this one? I must have. Just wanna uh, darken this corner up a little bit. That's all. All right. So that's all I'm gonna do. Pretty simple. Pretty easy. I mean, you could do it with any palette that you have. And where is it here? So, ah, la, 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 la. so I'm gonna use the brown eyeliner. Let's try this baby out. All right. I'm gonna go in with the mascara. So there is. I have to admit, that one was one of the creamiest eyeliners I have used. Um, this is like my favorite color, and I swear, it is not as creamy. Look how beautiful that is. Like, Maybe I lied. It is very creamy. The biggest pointers with these is not to have like that much out. Just make sure you have enough because if you do, it does break. So I just did the corners there just for, you know. Okay, let's use this. It's weird looking, it's weird looking in the um, mirror or in the uh, video camera because I can just see how big my eyes <laughs> look right now because I don't normally wear eyeliner like that, so I maybe need to start. Okay, so there's the mascara. I don't know, like, I'm probably, like, the worst person to show off mascara. Okay, guys, I'm going to try this. This is actually going to stay in my collection no matter what. I'm not a big fan of black licorice. I think it's really gross, but I'm going to try it for you all. So I am going to add, this has got to be one of my favorite uh, highlighters from him. I absolutely love it. So I'm actually going to go in with, I think, Candy Frost. Floss, Frost. I love rose gold. I just... I'm also going to take, now this is just still what I had before, and I just want to... Okay, so that is done. So let's go in with this liner. Okay, so I do have both of these right here and I just don't know. I think I'm gonna go actually with the Cherry Wet. It's more of a pink than a full red. So I think that would be better for this look. So let's see. Okay guys, what do you think of the look so far? I had envisioned this look and I'm really thrilled with the way it looked. Um, I didn't really pick the lips. I thought I was actually going to go with the Red Affair. So I'm really glad I didn't and I didn't know how the brown eyeliner would work but brown seems to work with blue eyes. Um, and I'm, I, I really do like this Cherry Wet. It is a gorgeous pink red color is beautiful. Um, I do have to go get my daughter and I don't feel bad about putting on some makeup and 
well, not feeling bad, but you know what I mean. I think I feel, I think I, I think I look okay to pick her up. I know I go out with some pretty wild looks and probably get a lot of weird looks, but hey, that's what makeup, makeup is just supposed to be fun and relaxing and, you know, you're supposed to spoil and pamper yourself too. Um, but anyway, guys, this is the look. Let me know what you think below in the comments. And if you kindly can, give this video a like if you liked it. Um, and yeah, give it a share. Also, let me know either here or on my Instagram if you'd like to see me live Wednesday at, let's say, I'm going to say probably 8 or 9, only because I have to make sure that Avalyn is in bed. So maybe 8.30. Um, usually I go to bed with her, but, uh, I can manage to stay up a little later that day. But anyway, guys, let me know what you think. And I really hope you have a good day. Um, yeah, I'll see you on the next video.